What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Big Baby Johnson. We got Laker breaking news, man. Rich Paul and Clutch Sports just talked to Genie Bus Rob Palinka, man. Um, to kill all that noise with LeBron leaving the Lakers, going back to Cleveland. Their focus is finishing the season out and then focusing on the offseason and try to win a championship for next season and finish out the season. You know, shout out to Rob Palinka, Genie Bus, Rich Paul, not to squash that noise. You know, um, they feel like that LeBron is still a focal point of the future here in Los Angeles, and I agree. Um, at first, I thought he was going to leave with all the tea leaves, but Rich Paul is LeBron's agent. So if it's coming from LeBron's agent's mouth, if it's in articles, if it's in from ESPN, if it says Rich Paul denies reports of LeBron leaving, then it's good. You know what I mean? It's going to be interesting to see what we do in the offseason because right now we're 27-31, and 31, ninth seed in the Western Conference. You know what I mean? We got to do better. We got a game tonight versus LA Clippers. Um, Clippers are 8C, we're 9C, so this is a big important game for us. I don't want to see no lack of days of good performance tonight. We got to do better with the hustle, great grind tonight. We have to do better. Anthony Davis is out. LeBron's going to probably take the majority of the offense, along with Russell Westbrook, Cameron Lanthony, and all the players that we have on our team. We have to do better, Laker Nation, coming out the second half, because we got 24, 24 more games left. If we do not pick up the pace, we're not making the playoffs. I'm telling you right now, if we do the same things we've been doing all year long, the last 24 games, we're not making the playoffs. And I can guarantee you, there will be change. You know what I mean? A lot of people ask me, you think the Lakers should trade LeBron? No, I think we should try to look to trade Anthony Davis because Anthony Davis has more value than, like, trade-wise than LeBron. You can get, like, a young asset. From, like, let's say if Sacramento says, we'll give you De'Aaron Fox and a couple of draft picks for Anthony Davis. I'll do that in Harvey to get the draft capital, get a good young point guard, Run the run the franchise with LeBron and um, De'Aaron Fox, and maybe even call up uh, Boston to see if we can get like a Jalen Jason Tatum for Anthony Davis, or you know maybe we could call Brooklyn get like a Kyrie or call Portland and say give me Dame because Damian Lillard wants to play with an All Star. You know what I mean? Lakers are gonna do everything in their power to turn this this team. I'm calling it right now that this, this team's not gonna be the same next season. We're gonna probably get rid of Frank Vogel. We're probably gonna get rid of. Everybody on our roster, besides Austin Reeves, LeBron, Ed. But if we do decide to trade some of our players, man, it's gonna be interesting to see what we do. But right now, our focus at hand is tonight versus LA Clippers. Man, come in, dominate like you always do, man, and do what we normally do. You know what I mean? We have to do a better job defensively, offensively. You know what I mean? Frank Vogel played Dwight Howard more. Play the big. Stop. Stop going small. Because every time you go small. You have like 60 plus points in the paint on the other team. You got to do better defensively. You know what I mean? Come out the second half. Guns blazing. You know, LeBron's going to do what he does. Drop 29, 7, and 7. Russell Vegas probably going to get 18, 9, and 7. And the others got to follow. You know what I mean? Austin Reeves probably going to get like 15 points tonight. It's going to be a close battle versus LA Clippers because every time Clippers and Lakers play, Clippers always uh, gear up and they play like really good against us for whatever reason. You know what I mean? We, we got we to gotta get revenge because last game against the Clippers, man, we almost had them. We got to do better. Anthony Davis went, almost hit the game winner, but he's out. Um, probably he's going to finish the season um, on the uh, not on the bench. Excuse me. But Anthony Davis is going to come back before the season's over. You know what I mean? And then we have to do a better job as a team and collective unit to get back at hand. Defensive assignments, you know what I mean? Talk on defense, rotate, you know, perimeter jump shots, get, get that going and all that good stuff. You know what I mean? If you're up big on this Clipper team tonight, don't fall asleep. You know what I mean? Do what you got to do, Lakers, to get this win, man. Um, our main goal is to uh, get the sixth spot. That's what Frank Vogel said today in the press conference. Um, he had before the like his practice report this morning. Um, his goal is to get the sixth seed, but they've got a lot of ground up to make. And I agree with Frank Vogel. You know what I mean? they got a lot of ground to make up. But we're going to see what happens tonight, man. 24 more games left this season, man. But make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Put your comments in the comment section down below about do you think the Lakers should keep LeBron, Trey Anthony Davis, Rebuild, trade everybody, and restart fresh, or keep AD and LeBron and trade Westbrook to get more assets and build around AD and LeBron. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Laker Nation, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Click the notification bell right here. Subscribe right here. Make sure you become part of Big Baby Sports Podcast, man. Until then, everybody, have a good, blessed night. We'll see you guys later. Peace out, Laker Nation. Peace out, one love, good luck, baby. Peace.